Oh. from home and everything. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds but, good. Poor Mark, he's such a hard worker. <laughs> He'll be back to play again and I hope that you'll join us. Wheel of Fortune, that's the name of the game. Happy Easter, everyone. Take care. We choose to fly Qantas, the Australian airline. The cast and crew choose to stay at Travelodge all around Australia. When we move, we move with Allied Pickford's The Careful Movers. John is dressed by Tony Bala menswear. Adriana dressed by Top Fashion House and Wild Child. And wears Raymond Fulton shoes. Adriana's hair is styled by Brisco Hair. Contestants receive red tulip chocolates. This is a Grundy Television production for the Seven Network Australia. David Day speaking. With Frank Warwick, this is Seven Nightly News. Tonight, a police hunt after a woman is gunned down in a Queensland hotel. The family mauled by their pet Doberman and a spectacular start to the Brisbane to Gladstone. Good evening, everyone. Police in the central Queensland town of Calliope near Gladstone have widened the hunt for a dangerous gunman who blasted a young woman to death in a local hotel. It's believed the killing was the result of a domestic dispute. The community of Calliope was almost deserted today, patrolled only by heavily armed police as residents sheltered indoors. The gunman, a 30-year-old local man, is well known to police who are taking no chances in the manhunt. Highly trained special emergency response team police provided backup. Hundreds of others packed South Bank with the restaurants and the markets among the handful of places open. There was street entertainment and, of course, the artificial beach. While on the Gold Coast, the real thing was even more popular. Ahead in Seven Nightly News tonight, a rescue mission for a snake bite victim and Christopher Reeve's new job in Hollywood. 